this is my uh, yellow PD patch that I have hooked up to Reactivision and uh, it will be tracking a fiducial which looks like this and I have it mapped over here to a PD program um, it's got two oscillators and a phaser a phaser is just a uh, ramp and down here we have the wave output and here is a, a fast Fourier transform of what the output looks like um, in here I have uh, the TUIO client that's communicating with Reactivision right here uh, with the high contrast uh, video that you see right now. Um, if I turn on or bring up a fiducial, this is fiducial number zero. As you can see it tracks and right in the middle uh, well, you'll see when I take my finger away, um, it will track the symbol and it will put a zero right where my finger is. Right there. Make it a little bit bigger, maybe. And now, as you can see over here, um, the X position, the Y position, and the angle, the rotation, with respect to. Uh, 0 to 250 is what I'm using right now in my program but you can make it 0 to 360 or 2 pi or whatever you would like and then the X and the Y is normally from from 0 uh, 0 is up here to 1 and same with Y I think it's 0 to 1 here but I have it mapped to uh, 100 and 250 and 250. So now if I come over here into my program um, and follow the uh, yellow brick road, uh, I can turn the, I'll set these to zero first. And I'll turn the audio on and you see down here uh, we have a FFT and a simple sine wave with no harmonics because it's just a sine wave. Now I'm going to pop on one of the fiducials and one of the first things you notice x-axis, y-axis, and angle um, come on the play and we get noise. So x-axis you can see And y axis will go to the middle. And we'll do some rotations. There you have it, a uh, working uh, PD patch mapping um, XY in angle to uh, three different oscillators.